Starting things off with the music section. Uh, so music is one of the biggest sections for this episode. Uh, again, this new structure for this section is really helping out. So uh, we do have one follow-up. I was uncertain of a thing in the tours uh, last episode, so I clarified it real quick. POD, the satellite record that they are on tour, the 20th anniversary uh, tour for, is the record that did have Youth of a Nation. It is not the Southtown record. The name of that record is the Fundamental Elements of Southtown. That was the one POD record I owned back forever ago, so my apologies that I forgot which one was which, but satellite is the one that made them blow up, even though... Wasn't my favorite. Anyway, so that's the correction for this episode. Uh, we do have one piece of regular news, and that has to do with Sean Crahan, the clown from Slipknot, is uh, producing more solo music and art. Uh, you can This technically is video announcements, but it's single announcements and a solo project announcement kind of all, in the, all rolled into one, so that's why it's getting in the regular news section. But uh, you can follow the links down in the description. You can see the two videos that he just put out for two songs. The first song is Brand Brainwashed Love, Dead Inside, and the second song is called Live Your Life. Um, I haven't listened to them. Again, things that are going on the list of, of reaction videos. I just need to do a giant thing of reaction videos one of these days. Uh, yeah, so new Crayhan music. His previous efforts have been kind of hit and miss, so I don't know where this one's going to land, but we will figure that out together in the reaction videos. Uh, then we're moving over to other new video announcements. Uh, new videos released since we last spoke. We have a Mr. Bungle video for Erasist, which again is a song off of the re re recorded version of their demo record that doesn't have all whatever it's mr bungle it's going to be great uh times of grace have released the second record off of their most recent uh, uh outing their most recent record uh the name of the record is songs of loss and separation which is not out just yet even though this is the second si single released from that record the re record releases on july 16th the newest song that they have released a video for is a track called medusa which is apparently one of the heavy your songs on the record, but again, reaction videos. All right, so uh, our next new music video comes from Billy Gibbons, the king of the rock and roll blues himself. Well, maybe not the king, but the one of the best living rock and roll blues players out there. Uh, his new solo record is doing very well. He has released a new video for the song She's on Fire. Again, link down in the description. And then our final video announcement comes from the world of pop. That's right, Lord. Do you remember her? Kind of uh, one of the more bright and shining stars of the pop world as of recently has released a new single called Solo Power or Solar Power rather. Um, no announcement as to if this is going to be attached to a record. No announcement as to whether or not this is you know anything beyond just this one single. Either way, it is a new Lord single. This one I did listen to because with all of the other reaction videos I have to do, this one is not likely to get done. So I just listened to the dang song uh and it's pretty good uh pretty solid pop track just like everything else she's put out up until this point so go check it out that's what we have for videos and then we have a couple of tours that have been announced since we last spoke first off we have devin townsend who is releasing a new record that he is then going to uh tour in support of the name of the record is light work and therefore the name of the tour is light work tour 2022 he is putting out another record between now and then it is just an ep it's not a major label release it's just something he's putting out on his own imprint uh light work though is going to be major label release and he is right now he's only scheduled to be touring europe uh the tour starts in april of 2022 uh, uh april 13th to be specific in dublin ireland at olympia i don't know how ireland is divided or whatever but it's li labeled as ireland dublin olympia so Sorry that I am ignorant to how that geography works over there in Ireland, but if you know, then you know, and there it is. Next, we're talking about Meshuggah. This is actually an announcement of a postponed tour. So we talked previously about the fact that Meshuggah is supposed to be going on tour now that COVID restrictions are lifting kind of in some areas. Well, not enough and not in enough areas for their take for their liking. So what they have done is they have rescheduled the exact same tour. I mean, the exact same places, not the same dates for a year back. So it's going to be 2022. They have added a couple of shows and again, 
It's all in freaking Europe. <laughs> uh, but this one, uh, they are starting the tour uh, May 5th of 2022 in Hamburg, Germany. Uh, and then our final piece of news comes from Black Label Society. Uh, Black Label Society is going on tour with Obituary and Prong. The first date of that tour, it's going to be a North American tour. First date of that tour is October 1st of this year, and it will be in Sacramento, California. So there you go, nerds. All of the music news worth talking about. 